Um, so just a quick overview of what we're going to cover today. I'm going to provide um, a, a brief overview of the microfinance space, trends we're seeing. I'll talk a little bit about Grameen Foundation, what we do, where we are, where we work. And then I'll share my thoughts on trends and developments in careers for microfinance and ideas for people who are interested in getting into the field. So starting on what is microfinance. I think most people who are on the call probably have a, a fairly good idea, but I thought it would be helpful to start out um, with the basics. And really, it, starting from the needs of poor households is really how we try to think about microfinance. We know that poor people need financial services for the same reasons we do. They need financial services to build assets, manage risk, manage daily cash flows, and accumulate lump sums that can be used, for example, to take advantage of an income generating opportunity. To do this, people need access to an array of financial services. We have heard a lot about microloans over the years, but microfinance is about much more than just loans. We look at savings as being a very critical instrument. Microinsurance is an increasingly important instrument as well to help poor households to manage against risks. And payments are increasingly, particularly in markets where mobile money and mobile financial services are taking off, payments are a gateway to other types of financial services for poor households. And by payments, we're talking about mobile payments, remittances, government to person or G2P payments. So that's a space where there's a lot happening right now. Um, briefly, you might hear the term microfinance plus. That typically refers to institutions that combine financial services with other interventions. For example, agriculture information for uh, farmer clients or health information or other types of, sort of education or information that may be useful to the clients of microfinance institutions. So major microfinance group, who is working in microfinance? So when you're thinking about career opportunities, there's a broad range of different types of institutions that you might consider. The first and most obvious is, of course, microfinance institutions themselves. And many people I know have sort of started out their careers in microfinance by taking volunteer assignments or other positions actually in a microfinance institution. A second area are the network organizations, and Grameen Foundation falls into that category. Other names that you're probably quite familiar with are Axion, Opportunity International, Women's World Banking, Finca, Vision Fund, Promohair International are just some examples of the network organizations. The network organizations typically work with a group of microfinance institutions globally, providing technical assistance, capital, and other support to help uh, grow the institutions and improve the quality of products and services. 